This is High Command Sun Traffic. Go ahead and give the brief. I guess I'll be ground command. Solid. Uh, first off, anyone joined in and they had errors with uh, Ace basically saying that they had the wrong mod set, make sure they're kicked out accordingly so they fix their damn mod set. Other than that, today we are acting as a fast respond force after a small domestic incident within the lands of Mother Russia. Basically, I would like for you to go over to Point Tallow and look for an abandoned military base. We are looking for an HVT that I have already spawned and surrendered within our base. I will be standing right next to him for reference, but you need to capture this HVT because we believe he has intel on possible future attacks. If he is not at the abandoned military location at Tallow, search for intel to find whereabouts of his location. Notice that it's in a large forest, and I'm assuming these gorillas know it well, so be careful. Any questions? Uh, what kind of equipment do we know the gorillas have? They are well armed with Russian based equipment and armor. Basically, the camo scheme this guy is wearing is the camo scheme they'll have. They'll probably have body armor as well, since it's their territory, so be careful. Alrighty, then. Sethnaz versus Rebels. Yeah, sounds about right, right? <laughs> These asshats getting caught in a tree. Yep. Alright, everybody get your fucking squads and shit set up. Alright, what's going on, guys? Lee Ryu here. Am I expecting them to get wiped with this one? No, not really. This is just a very simple operation. I'm pitting Russians against the Cherno Russian people. Let me also make sure that, uh, they'll shoot each other. Just in case, because I always like to check. Hey! Well, it works. But it's basically... I'd like to call it a scavenger hunt, because they're going to go here. There's intel up here that's going to tell them to go here. And that intel is going to tell them to go here and here. And then in that in-between area where this large patrol is going is the officer. In that building. But... Here and here is where the intel trail ends, but hopefully as they come through, they will find that central compound. Hopefully. They also have drones up, so they should be able to see shit, but just in case, I'm gonna send a large squad. Put it around right there. And I'll also be bringing in reinforcements from other parts of the AO to uh, come in and assist. But I'm basically setting up a bunch of other roamers. Now let's set up our global skill. Let's do a 90. It's thick forest, so I'll put it up to 65. And accuracy will bump down to 35 and 50. That should be good. And we'll see how this all goes. Yeah, usually by their own stupidity. You're not wrong. Hey, uh... Ground command vehicle tends group. to happen uh, a lot. Here for what we have for vehicles, two BDRM, one in the ET variant. So I've got multiple ETRM. pieces of AA. But since we're also doing some testing because certain vehicles and munitions seem to crash the server, that thing took off like a jet again. That's a glitch, but um, <laughs> I've limited them to these two transport VICs. Rocket, BDRM, and a machine gun BDRM. As well as aircraft that they could use to transport. Uh, okay, that's another one that is not connecting with the right mod set. One second. Uh, let's see, where's dead goal? Now I got a Pokemon team speak. Take a 
It's people. <laughs> One of the reasons that the server's been crashing a lot is people have not been connecting with the right mod set. I finally calibrated things so everything... Uh, it, it'll say what mod they're missing, and I'll just kick them and tell them what mod they need. And until they get it right, I'll keep kicking them. But one of the things you gotta do is an administrator. Also, one of them, some of them seem to be spawning on the damn roof, so we've been rappelling down. Even though the rope is broken? Question mark? I don't know. I don't know. The butterfly mind dispensers. <laughs> All right, pockets, my score. Oh, you want some goats on the player base? Fine. Anything for you, Mr. Moneybags, since you're the fucking sugar daddy of the channel. <laughs> I mean, it is a barn after all. We might as well put some goats in. I don't know what flying Finn but did, but I think he's crashing right now. Just in case they decide to shoot him. I think they're getting caught on the pole, that's why they look like they're running in place. <laughs> Tootie, I really don't want to do testing purposes right now. Uh, I had a bunch of guys test a bunch of different munitions, and the results were really inconclusive. Otherwise, we'll see how it goes. So, KA is in the air. That thing with thermal strobes will be able to pretty much see a majority of what I got in the AO. I'm not expecting to be able to shoot down in the air unless they do really stupid stuff. Also, these guys are bringing in field mortars. I mean, it's not a, it's a big AO, but it's fairly spaced out for what I've got in terms of enemy units. In all honesty, they could probably use IR strobes to spot where these camps are. I mean, that one's the only really well hidden one, but we'll see based on what the, uh, what the KA spots, what the drone spots, and what intel they find. Otherwise, we got about 20 or so people on the server. Yeah, if they say they're trying to rescue him, that's good enough for me. As long as they don't kill him, we won't have an issue. Otherwise, Sniper Wolf and Bill, I think, have buddied up to get in this chopper. They're getting pretty fucking high here. Yep. And that should be fine. So they're marking this as a dismount point, and then they'll come over here and take care of that camp. Alright, that works. We'll see how this all goes. Roland, you read me? Well, no, here's the thing. I got an MI-28, and I also have a KA on the field, so... Uh, go ahead and gather your squad. You know. We're talking about the KA-52. It's up. It's available, the Black Shark, but again, it depends on what they want to use. But otherwise, if I'm using the MI-28. I'll take Bravo since I'm on fucking frequency 70. Uh, <laughs> Mookie, I'd say it's 50-50 if they uh, kill the freaking HVT. I hope they don't kill the HVT. But knowing these guys, it is entirely possible. Otherwise, from the looks of it, they'll probably form into two or three large or medium-sized teams. I'll have to work on it from there. Really? <laughs> Why 
Why can't we call the 52s black sharks? They're two seaters. Ah, uh, whatever. Gray sharks. Something sharks. Who knows? What happens if they do kill the HVT? Then the next mission, which is going to be a patrol, is going to be even fucking tougher because the fucking rebels are going to be pissed. Furthermore, when they try to extract them, there's going to be rebels trying to grab them. They're sending a third drone up now. No explosives. Yeah, or they might accidentally mortar the building and kill him. Who knows? That's happened before. And that's a piece of chest ring glitch now? What the fuck? Yeah, I mean... Here's the deal. If they overwatch from this, I trust Bill and Sniper Wolf not to get shot down compared to someone like Rube, but... You know, I do have AA pieces around just in case. But if I see them on my render distance of about two and a half clicks, I will shoot them down. But... Well out of my range. Back. But yeah, it's all about the setup. Anyway, if you guys think you have an idea to add to this AO, I just, um, I always invite people to add stuff, but I do have to say, A, remember, these guys are rebels and they're within their own territory, so there's no reason for them to set up defenses because they don't know I'm coming. And B, there's no point of using IEDs in friendly territory when, again, we don't know they're coming. But see, they're already starting to mark out some of these uh, camps. Yeah, small camp. They're already looking at things with thermals from the imaging camera. Can we get more goats? For the love of... We already have goats. I don't want to kill the server with goats. Go ahead and load you guys up on top of the BDRMs. We're going to be moving out here shortly. Also, Pockets, the HVT is the guy in the corner. Confirm. Is that killer capture? Mines again. We don't know they're coming. Confirm. Maybe no, after we lose the main base, base we can set up a few mines, but otherwise, like, we, we don't know they're coming yet, so... I do have a few defensive statics set up because, you know, defensive statics are good. It's just a few dishkas, though. These guys don't really have much. And I also have some, uh, igla chairs set up, some man pads. Yep. Do you have a JTAC guy on the ground? Otherwise, I don't have much. No. We'll pretty much just be recording the shit. Solid I might set up a cornet later. Yeah, so they're gonna do recon unless it quote unquote goes to shit. They're going to need. Right now, you're looking yep, at a take another pick. Maybe 20 to 30 dudes, if that. One technical that I can see. Bob's your uncle. A little walled area. Yeah. Got an AA piece on top of one of the big prefab towers and one cargo post looking. I think they're trying to organize south, to yeah. fit everyone in these two VIX. So there are there are infantry looking south as well as a couple patrols around the There are tower. there is a spare seat inside. But for the most part everything that's in the base is kind of looking southwest ish besides. Yeah, they're the taking that other spare seat. Saw, so, did you see anything along the route I have on the map? Going up to the farm and then driving uh, north, 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 north. Yeah, so five on top. Why doesn't that guy just get on the fucking gun yeah, turret clear, if he's we'll gonna the, uh, uh, sit on the top? I'd, uh, I'd rather have someone in the damn turret. <laughs> That's none of my business. No, I'm not seeing anything obvious, but obviously keep your eyes open. Solid copy. Uh, patrolling technical... Yeah, we could do that. We could do that. Let's see. I'll read the others in a second. I'll just have to call it in because they're getting IR strobes on her right now. That should work. Uh, Shack Tack Dark Business. I don't know what that is. 
I know Shaktak is someone within the Arma community, and I know he's has a mod called his interface, which is fairly nice for people, but... Um, yeah, that's all I got. I don't really follow other Arma YouTubers, uh, except for 506 guys, because I do work with them. But other than him, that's really it. Like, I'm too busy with my own stuff these days. Car with the Dishka hidden in the back. Yeah. We'll start getting more crafty as these operations continue and I start filtering in civilians, but right now, nah. Old T-62 or T-55. I'm actually really worried about using Armored Vix against them right now because I'm... Again, there's been a lot of server crashing. The results have been inconclusive, but a lot of it has been after Ace cooked off on certain Vix. So I just... I don't want another fucking server crash today because that would be like three in a row. That'd be a pain in the ass. I get your gravity. I don't know, maybe. But I, an idea like that, honestly, I'd say there's a high chance my player base would botch that because they're they're public players. They don't want anything too serious. They just want to have fun. I mean, sure, that's a nice concept to think about, but these guys aren't really about that. They just want to chill. Yeah, I hear you, man. I got I got a lot of people testing it right now. We're just trying to see what the fuck is going on, because for all we know, Tac Ops fucked something up. Ah, uh, nothing, Miss Rube. Oh yeah, we roasted your flying a bit. <laughs> Other than that, normal day. Convoy, go ahead and take a left on this dirt road and follow it up and around. I don't want to get too close to the river. Just take a, uh, take a back road. I just thought I heard an explosion. Huh, okay, that must that must have been the music, but I could have sworn I heard, like, distant mortar Convoy, fire. Next chance you get, take a left onto the dirt road. I'll copy. Taking your left. Next chance you get, take a left onto the dirt road. Ground command, this is high You're command, you copy? This is uh, ground command, send traffic. Roger, I got two times late joiners. Uh, how do you want me to address them? Uh, do we have any ATVs at base? Uh, we still have one times uh, mortarized MRAP. Uh, send them up in that. It's on the follow the route uh, drawn on the map. And they should be able to handle themselves. Stop. All right, late joining Dum Dums. Get to the MRAP. Also, uh, high command, tell, uh, ask them to tune their short ranges to 70. They're going to be tune your short ranges to 70 so you can get tasked. There's an MRAP still on the airfield. Use it. Thanks. Agreed, agree. Did you freaking rappel down, Gabian, or did you actually yeah, jump yeah. off like a dumbass? Probably jumped off like a dumbass. Because he's crippled. Ah. Uh, whatever, we'll see what's going on. Uh, Rube, no, I don't have the spectator stuff set up for this operation. I'll set up for, uh, Monday, though. Because Monday they did exceptionally well, and I want to definitely capture that. What are we doing today? We're basically officer hunting for capture. We'll see how it goes. Yeah, Rube, feel free to jump in. I, I don't really care. Just, you know, you've seen some of the base, so you're not allowed to, like, tell them where anything is. Standard rule applies. Ground command, get on net with your drone guys. There's low-flying drones heading toward the AO. Are they for real? 
solid copy. Make sure everyone, if you are piloting a drone, some did just fly the over the damn thing because they left it automated like dumbasses. Not be that close to the AO. A minimum click away from the AO. Let me grab the Igla guy, see if you can see anything. We'll see. I think it's still fairly high up, because it's... I'm literally looking for a little black speck in the sky, but I don't see it. They still got it fairly far up. Also, these trees are kind of fucking thick, so... Yeah, but basically they have to... We know that they have a position in here. Let me task this guy back in. But we know they have a position here at an abandoned military base. That military base is going to have intel, which is going to put them here. And then this place has two pieces of intel here and here, which is going to point them here and here. So hopefully they'll then close the gap on the officer's actual location, which is here. In between the two camps. So it's a bit of a common sense test. And then that will be our patrol for our roaming technical. I think he'll be able to come off the road down here. And then follow this, which looks like a dirt path. Yeah, so just a break. That should be doable for him. Then again, sometimes I ask apparently too much of the AI and they all go retarded, so... Let's reset our global skill here. Got our main force coming in. Also, I've always forgotten to do this, but put up my monitor settings for debugging mode in case the server decides to take a dump, I can quickly fix it before it completely crashes. <laughs> They're dicking around with the missile tube box. Hey, Viking. Viking, did you get your freaking package yet? I hope DSL still isn't being a dick. But uh, yeah, Viking won a raffle literally a month ago. And the damn package is... <laughs> I wish international shipping could be better. You had a girlfriend's out? I don't know what that means, but if, I, actually, that's probably innuendo for something. I don't want to know, Rube, so... How many ops am I doing today? Um, this one, and I'm doing just a large patrol for testing purposes. Yeah, DSL. Whatever you call them. DSL is probably internet, right? Whatever. We all know I can't English anyway. Oh yeah, and according to YouTube, I have meaty hands, so... <laughs> yeah, FedEx were being cucks and they weren't taking it international, so... Not much I can do. Am I from North America or EU? Uh, I'm from North America. I'm currently around the DC metropolitan area. Desync. That's why we have spacing. That is exactly why we have spacing. But uh, servers are based in France. My servers are, at least. That's because we have people from all around the damn world play. Okay, it's a low depression ground command. You want, to, you want this amount of people here and walk them in? Will I have any Christmas day or night ahead, streams? Um, we're gonna, we're gonna I will. I will definitely have something for Christmas. Um, probably an afternoon to evening stream for Christmas, unless my family has plans. But uh, otherwise, an Eve stream. But it's it's difficult because the twenty third is my anniversary of Bloodwing. Not sure. I think she's still here. Probably in the bedroom. Um, <laughs> but that's our anniversary day, and then the twenty fourth. I'll probably do something. That's the day I'll most likely have something to do. Someone said something about. Uh, and then Christmas Day, it really depends. The, um, the BDRM fix. Confirm, we have more to throw that in the BDRM. Squad leads, just DHL, that's what it's called. DSL's internet, DHL's the fucking place. The objective because we need the 
guy inside, but if you but Barbarian, money, I hope you've gotten it by now. At this money. rate, if it's international, I might just send people the money to buy it because it's just too much of a freaking hassle to get it shipped from my place. It's it's so stupid. So stupid. Uh, no problem, Soviet. No problem. Alright, so that last uh, VIX still coming up. They have their VIX on standby, the and they're bringing up this VIX with them. So you just gotta find a thin spot to cross. How's that car doing? Alright, it was able to do that patrol around. Oh, I tried to call Barvarian Barvarian. It's just maybe my V's sound like B's. Because we... A classic meme of this channel is I cannot English well. Hell, Bloodwind has started to make me play a game called Doki Doki Literature Club. And we've been voicing the characters. And I've been narrating. And every time I screw up on English, you're supposed to take a shot. Every time one character just doesn't say anything, it says dot dot dot. She slaps me. And that'll be going to YouTube probably within a week. And my cheeks are still fucking sore, because they do that a lot. Bravo's in position waiting. Godly, I mean, oh. by all means, surprise me. Like, I, I love surprises. Unless it's arsenic. In which case, that's bad, but... <laughs> nah, I'd, I'd like to do a few unboxing videos. I'm working on... Uh, another series called Lira's Two Cents, and that's just talking about a few gray areas of the interest that I'm actually kind of passionate about. Such as the whole pay-to-win gray area Tarkov's created. I think it's a really interesting topic that we need to learn about a bit more, because, you know, there may be multiple arguments to a problem. However, there's never, in these arguments, a single solution. And we'll talk more about that, hopefully, in the coming few days when that video is made. Tootie. <laughs> nah, see, this channel will always be Zeus content. I will always guarantee an Arma video or two released every day. That's my goal, and if I fail on that goal, I better have a good goddamn reason of why I didn't do it. Otherwise, there's no harm in, you know, trying new stuff, but I do absolutely hate YouTube channels that grow an audience on something that's unique, that's their bread and butter, and then they completely switch it up, and then they cry when they lose all their fan base. I absolutely hate those channels because it's, it's kind of obvious why you lost your fan base. But do we really just have a guy crawl in front of another guy's firing line, like for fuck's sake? Also, I think I did a good job on this camo. Matches pretty well, but for VMF, another one crossing in front of a guy's fucking firing line. But I think they're waiting for Killa and Gabian to push up with them, and Sniper Wolf and Bill. Man, the footbridge to the left side for the toward the northernmost river is literally shallow enough you could probably just walk across without even taking the bridge. Solid. Yeah, they're gonna take that, or they could they could walk through there. And Druza got kicked oh, off. <laughs> no, if you if you ever want to binge watch my channel, the best drinking game you could play is every time Andruza gets kicked off for some stupid reason because of his internet or his mod set, you take a shot. Like that is a great way to get lip lucid or whatever the fuck the term is. And then still get drunk by like after I'd say a four or five hour just binge a thon. Because it's just the perfect amount of kicks. <laughs> Are they afraid of getting wet? I guess. Teacher doesn't care. He's just gonna swim across or he actually fell off the bridge. <laughs> ay ay ay. Yeah, what is spacing? Who knows? I will probably I mean I could just make them dead. I've thought about doing video logs because I do have a few funny stories to tell, but just Those will be rare. Those will be very, very rare. I thought about doing one, but... Eh. Not my cup of tea. No, Andrews is a, Andrews is a good player. It's just he's from South, uh, South Africa. So his internet is very, very... Eh.
Yeah, but I can just cross the Vex like that. What's that blood? So I don't have to wait for porn. <laughs> uh, I forget the play where that's from. But I saw, I've seen it. No, it's not Book of Mormon. It's something. Yeah, it's, it's a parody of Sesame Street. Say again? How bad is the foliage? The foliage is pretty fake up here. You want to say hi, blood? Roger that. I'm going to rethink our movement. Hi, blood. The oh, funny. Avenue Q. That's it. Yes. Yes, it's Avenue Q. Look at you. What? He's so smart. Well, no, someone said it in I know, chat. I know. Okay. <laughs> oh, thank you. It's thank called you. a joke. Yeah, it's, it's called thank you. Thank you. All right, hi, so we hi. went from Hello. Hello. Hi. commentary to insult my intelligence. Oh, Isn't that what commentary is? Yep. Basically, it's either the player base is stupid or you're stupid. I just can't English. 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 Barbarian gives me a dollar. Bavarian Viking. Alright, that's good. That's good to know it came Thursday. Alright. Glad it showed up finally, but international shipping's a bitch. <laughs> uh, ben, also, I appreciate it. I, I will admit, I can't really stand other Zeus's either too much, because they either focus on cinematics, or some of the stuff I see some Zeus's throw at players is just stupid like right now if i were a different zeus they'd be sending like three tanks at them and the engagement hasn't even started yet compelling commentary yeah uh, it's Lenora, it's annoying when i see that because uh, i try to do realistic and i try to do realistic uh, punishments or if i'm pissed off then we get to unleash hell on them and usually that's unrealistic uh, enough but it's always something that I know if they are doing everything right, they can still handle in the end. Because I've seen this player base wipe entire fucking battalions before. I've tested it. These guys, when they have their head in the goddamn game, can literally wipe any possible thing I could throw at them. Funny. <laughs> But I think they're gonna assault from the north. They might run into this patrol. Wart, wart, wart. Oh god, that that mission was amazing. None of us died. I still can't believe it. <laughs> so I think first contact's gonna be between this squadron and these guys. So slowly gear ourselves to game mode. Got great music to do it. Hi, Boo. That's my headset. <laughs> And getting wiped by two goat farmers and bolt action snipers. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking Lee Enfield. Stop. Yeah, please stop bothering me. No. <laughs> bother me <Wu. laughs> See. <sighs> Minefields are a very slippery slope for Zeusing. Because technically you can put them anywhere in so long as the operation or area is justified. Then it's technically okay, but otherwise, <laughs> things have. Oh god. With regards to a minefield. Ground team, just they got a pretty good layout we, on the map of what the base kind of looks like for the most part. I just with the went. The and everything marked. A while ago, we had that sliding goat. Otherwise, just the right. sliding minefield sure goat. Have have that again. Those guys with their Another sliding but goat. But it activates a minefield. We like could technically put an IED on it and then course. trigger no, 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 it no, no, remotely. No. You don't yeah, understand. We're, we're so. our job. I wanted to go through the minefield. Good God. <laughs> That's just a desyncing goat. Hold on. This <laughs> is high command send traffic. If the HVT is fleeing, uh, do we have permission to fire to kill? Or are Negative. You follow and, and capture. Solid copy. Uh, recon, if you see that All right, we're gonna have to start getting to serious mode because contact is gonna be broken within a minute. Break. Whatever the frontmost squad is to the uh, to the base. Yeah, they're about to say they're about to run into contact. Literally to your east right now. About twelve guys walking toward you. About two hundred meters. Away. All right, contact. We're gonna switch to a different scope here. Now we're going to fight them. Right, that's Bravo. 
Bravo's the southern closest to the objective. Here we go. Everything is alerted at the base now. Good luck. Alpha double time at Send this car out. Move it uh, to outflank them. Uh, you're all starts moving. I want you, get, I want you to do your best to follow it. You want me to just, you want me to just kill it now? Uh, Two men already down. Bravo team's gonna move in to outflank this large group. Woo! He's getting fucked. So those, those guys were purple wounded, so just getting them out. Alright, so they've woken back up. Bit of smoke parps. Alright, I got a bunch of patrols out here. I'm going to try to send some to reinforce. Yeah. Get <laughs> Basically send these guys to come in and reinforce. I'm actually gonna move their waypoint a little bit over here. Now they're gonna start moving in. We're still seeing some suppression on their position. But by the time these guys get over it, it might be too late. I'm gonna try to find a hidden position down here to spawn in another squadron. Not the National Guard, I'm gonna stick with ground troops. Fire mission complete, uh, last round impact in 10 seconds. So they just did a mortar strike on this location. I think they're doing it for smoke, at least they should be. So otherwise that's a very dangerous game to be firing oh, HE shells. Yep, so Crazy they smoked it. That's all that smoke is a bit of a miss. Side of the base. The question mark? So the side of the base. <laughs> right on the question mark. Sure. So the wrong that's, that's the marker for the military base. Love, they basically the they overshot. Yeah, it's not a fucking pinpoint. They're like, yeah, sure. You... <laughs> yeah, that's where it's supposed so to go. So the reason it all went here is they just said over radio that they're using the artillery computer. And the artillery computer, depending on the range, is not always 100% accurate. But at this range, especially for Ace modded. <laughs> That's that's his symbol. <laughs> he infested Daka has a biggie smalls fetish. But my point is, small, it's better small. to use a range card than the artillery computer for Ace because the artillery computer is not always a hundred percent accurate. So I got this squad coming up. I did spawn a fresh squad. I'm gonna call in one more over here, break them apart, and send them. And that smoke can really help or hinder the player base at this point, because it's going to be giving the enemy troops a little bit of an advance uh, surprise. Unless it starts to dissipate early. Uh, looks like most of the infantry in the prefab tower is down. Uh, you just got to check your surroundings. So they somehow flipped my turret. We got a few guys looking down and shooting at them. Timer to Lero death starts now. I'm gonna get in a truck and try to drive away. And I get shot. <laughs> See, well, timed, timed very shortly. I'm gonna try to get in a UAZ. Five, four. Bravo has reached the compound. Three. Two. Send in Confirm, ghost Bravo, teams. One. FS tower. Aviator. Uh, then, Six months uh, in a row, uh, man. Nice. I like cake. <laughs> yeah, I can't really escape when they've got the main entrance locked down by Teacher and Makarov. Otherwise, the Anders trying to crawl out a bit. But FS Aviator, thanks for the continued support, my friend. I hope you keep enjoying the operations, and I hope you enjoy this one in particular. Well, let's see, I got multiple units coming out. Their arrival looks like, I want to say, two minutes tops. Watch for this this one definitely at least two minutes, two and a half minutes. So I need to come up and breach this tower. How do you flip a turret? Grab this intel. It's Arma. These things it's always get fucking Arma. flipped somehow. <laughs> it's not table it's flipping in Arma, in it's assist. turret flipping in Arma. Can't really do much. Hey, Rage! Smoke flipped over. 
All right, this has left me with a very good opportunity. I'm gonna take advantage of it. Hey, Bravo, your BDRM keep taking RPG fire. Tell him to double, double time it out of there. He's on top, top of the prefab. Clear out the top of the prefab. Be advised, we found intel. Confirmed, top of the prefab tower. There's an RPG guy just nuking you. Be advised. Bravo, uh, Bravo's inside the tower. Take him out now. Solid. He's just coming the stairs. Uh, check the fire, put on full auto. Oh come on! I had to have traded with them there, but they found the first bit of intel, and I traded with Grizzly. <laughs> oh, my guy woke up and then. Oh. Grizzly. Ah, oh, I couldn't get the gun up in time. Ah, that's fine. We both wake up after shooting each other five times. Bravo said they found intel. Um, so All right, so that intel is gonna lead them up here. Gonna cook that off. Ground command, I've got intel. Bravo, you can move in here. Intel, uh, Are they so trying to fake a dead body? Area, grid ref, zero, <laughs> no. Eight, five, no. No. Why are you guys before. obsessed with medicking dead bodies today? Not again. Hold on. So it looks like the air support is basically murdering some infantry here. I'm gonna teleport myself up, break myself away, hide myself, because I always like to question what the hell they're doing. He's not dead, he's just sleeping. Guys, why are you medicking a dead body again? Now, command orders for Bravo. Uh, Bravo, you take the southern line towards the hero marker uh, at the uh, Gridrath 085. Uh, yeah, one of them said, I fucking told you, but... <laughs> ground Command, this is High Command, do you copy? This is Ground Command, for traffic. Roger, remind your medics that if there's a dead body, there's no way they're gonna be able to, uh, revive them, okay? Uh, solid copy. Relay the information to the squads. Yeah, no shit, relay the information to the squads. For the love of God, we always see that at least once a month we catch them trying to medic a goddamn dead body. Command, what was the uh, path you want Bravo to take? The southern one? Uh, hold on that for now. I want you to reinforce Alpha. That vehicle's sure in the front, and this guy's running down the road to join up with his units. If I see that Vic, I'm gonna blow it up. How copy, Bravo? What's Alpha's position? Ooh. Yep, alright, I see the it. Side of the I just got crippled. Like getting wiped hard right now. Alpha, do you copy? Hi, blood. Yeah, Bob, I want you to all right, Andrews, I want to TP, so I gotta teleport to the ATP, the RM. Got a lot of dead bodies. Bravo, we're alone. Alpha's dead. Shoot everything. Player teleport, but looks like they're getting absolutely schwacked. So there's Andruza. He's come back after his first crash. They have five men down up here. No, six men down up here. Allied vehicles coming up. They're pushing medics to the front line, but they need to be quick. Bra or Grizzly's team, mark your position with colored smoke, please. Copy. So they're gonna mark positions with colored smoke. But yeah, basically that front force took the blunt of these guys and got absolutely hammered as the second, uh, as Grizzly's team was basically pushing out the compound to assist. So we're gonna delete bodies here. I'm gonna give, uh, Sniper Wolf something fun to shoot at. Let me get a truck. Marking position with red smoke. I know it's But bad. basically they need to now conduct a lot of medical because, uh, they got a mass cas over at that position. So let's see. I want a good old truck. That is a good old truck. Just need to pull back in the compound real quick and medic up. You guys are a fucking lot dying. English. 
Alright. Have him unload there. Let's get my global AI skill up. Back to its original position for all those units spawn. We still got a few guys Bravo, coming into our flank. To, uh, they got one of their guys up. They still have uh, five down. The combat can't handle that. We can't support too much Attempting to right now. So some of them are attempting to pull back because they don't know how much. They're not coordinating with their air or their drones to get IR strobes panned over. Pockets is coming in. Is he going to fucking run them over? Nah, but he's pull hitting trees. So they're going to pull back, actually. Which gives me a really good opportunity to counterattack, but I have nothing to really counterattack with. Spawn Mr. Fluffy. If you mean Sergeant Fluffers, I always have to make them beforehand. But I'm going to try to use this opportunity. To call in some BTR support. I gotta select them all to move though. There we go. And then when he gets there, I'll unload that infantry and I'll try to conduct a counter-offensive. MI-28's coming in close to do a missile run. Excuse me, a rocket run. Were those explosions you air? Yeah. Good job. Here's RTP to refuel and rearm, so we'll be back. Alright, so they just did that to uh, burn ammo. These guys would have heard that. A lot of fuels. Where is my Igla team? I know I have another Igla team somewhere. Oh, there they are. Copy. Gonna send three of these guys to an open area over here. And we're going to try to prevent that from happening again. These two guys are still up. And it looks like we're starting to take casualties too. So they're gonna need to be reinserted. But I'm going to have these guys hold the fort. Actually, no. Better idea. Better idea. Ah, oh, no. They're going to all die too much. I was going to try to take a hostage. Oh, well. Um. Yeah, the map is back at top. So, unfortunately, all of them were killed off in that engagement. So, they're going to need right, to be reinserted. Bravo is fully up. Don't know if we got yeah, they're glitching out in this up. building, so they're spawning on the roof, but we get some oh, nice copy. repelling action. So hopefully when uh, Sniper and Bill RTB... Doesn't look like it. Let me quickly... Solid copy. Uh, we're going to uh, send... Hey, Boo, can you hit the lights when you got a sec? ...on that southern line towards the objective. Thanks, Boo. Um, AR, you are, are back for R&R. Okay. I'm going to quickly Solid. give them some ammo trucks and whatnot. Then we will do. Uh, Air, this is high command. Be advised, R and R bits have been provided at base. Copy. Thank you. The trick is to uh, do it before they uh, ask. Andrews, what could you stop a vehicle from gonna resupply from you? The Deadpool. The Deadpool. A, uh, 12 bullets per person. <laughs> it's like an advanced game, a gun game. Oh, well, we can do that. Alright, these guys have been deployed. I'm going to ungroup them. Resend them to attack. I do have a mortar somewhere. So they end up taking six the, uh, casualties. Jeez, we still got a guy in the field for spotting. I'm going to the, uh, the, uh, start conducting marks. some artillery rounds with my suppressive fire order. Andrews, are you good? Where is my mortar? There she is. Eric Gurr, thank you for the $10 spot, my friend. I appreciate it. I hope you keep enjoying these operations. Yeah, <laughs> capture them. Never mind, they're dead. So we're going to start putting some artillery near them because I got these two guys here that are still capable of spotting. Otherwise, they're going to need to start considering moving. Uh, Bravo, be advised. Hostages. Uh, we can all English. I feel you, man. Possible VTR-70 approaching from the, um, the north on the uh, logging trails. Hey, we got a VTR-70 coming in from north. 
Possible mortars. Possible Our mortars. mortars. We need to double time it. We're, we're, we're you know what that means? Get moving, guys. We're still fucking packing. We're all crippled. I know. Load them into, but... load them into the Kavan deck. We're just gonna have to do it on up. middle. Jesus. I'll give them some leeway for the mortars because one just said we they're all crippled, but. Now. I'll wait till after the reinserts uh, land. And I'll do something. Now, I'm no expert on choppers, but I'm pretty sure that's not how they take off. Don't they have to do the spinny spinny first before they start levitating in the goddamn air? <laughs> So Sniper Wolf's gonna go land them as Bill Man. Andrews again, the main route in front of us. Come it's R and R to the uh, vehicle. I'm sending a bunch of my guys into your vehicle. I'm watching that road directly. Go up the road a little bit more and cover down the way because it's gonna hit us first if it comes our way. Ah, uh, I'm going to conduct the artillery fire. Put it a bit back in their corner. Keep the pressure on them. Pull back. Keep them freaked out, but not actually hit them. So, about 30 seconds till that one lands, but what they should be considering to do is load everyone in the VIX and try to get them the heck out of there if they're all crippled. So, they're taking out one of my spotters right now. Got the machine gun lined up on them. But I also have these massive forces coming in as well as a BTR-70 to try to outflank them. And again, in case I missed any units, let's reset our global. Uh, Mortars should be touching they, uh, down any another, second uh, now. Here's a, get to the Y in the road. Follow the road up. We get to the wide road. <laughs> Ooh, I'm sorry, are you that guys was getting pushed back right now? Negative, we're moving forward while we're getting RD'd. Hey, firm, is there a clear LZ I can jump your fuckboys off in? My boot. I'm looking for one. Oh, they're pushing Negative up right, right on the BTR. I'm putting him next to the goddamn base then. This should be fun. Andrews, where the fuck are you at with that vehicle? You yell again over goddamn shit. Love you, boo. Crap! 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 Ah, <laughs> he's got rockets. Oh. Vehicle, give me status update. Shit, Taki. Ow. That thing just literally bombarded me. Yeah, that, that was sniper VCR coming in. <laughs> Good to let me know that there's a fucking armored vehicle sitting on the goddamn base, guys. Come on. Get him! Ah! Get over there. Hold on, one of you stay. One of you stay. We have a hostage. Hmm. What do we have here? Let's see. First, you cap. And you're awake. Ah, uh, what's wrong? You okay? Enemies behind us to the west. <laughs> he just fucking airstriked us. <laughs> he fucking, he fucking airstriked hey, take your us. Team east. Leave, leave everyone who's not on a vic behind. We need to pull back. Oh my Go ahead, God. east. We're going towards the objective. I can't. Fucking no mercy, oh, eh? We're rocket. dead. Damn. 
Oh my god. Yeah. So RPGs are now going off against specific VIX. But they need to regroup Daka, and re-attack. Yeah, no hostage for me. It wasn't an airstrike. Tank with rocket on roof. Eh? What? Regardless, something got me. <laughs> but yeah, they're going to try to push south. They need to swing the reinforcements around. And we know they went that Doctor, way. Do you copy? Suck is down. Where am I going? We're going southeast. South south east. Towards, uh, uh, away from the uh, away from the tower. Still got it off. I'm not sure if it hit him. But that was a D sinky ride. Yep, yeah, still got him. <laughs> I don't think he's okay. I don't think he's okay either, Eric. <laughs> oh man. But the force of Beketov, I don't know why, but they always cause some pretty crazy issues. But reinforcements are coming in. There needs to be more coordination over radio. Where's Alpha Squad? Where's Bravo Squad? Where are the reinserts? Where can we come in to then regroup? Because right now, the attack from the guerrillas is going exceptionally well. And it all kind of faltered when they lost their air support because they're r and r -ing. And they're still conducting r and but they're probably going to be forced to call in more reinsert runs. But no, my guys are... I want to call in mortars, but my guys are too spaced out around. There's no dedicated mortar positions is Bravo lead up? to use. Bravo lead is up. Um... But let's see. I still got a good amount of forces here. I'm going to say rendezvous over here, and then we'll reattack what we can. But, I, you know, it's nice to have them all going through the woods, hunter-killer style. Hey, let your squads know RVs marked on map. We're to move to the RV, and we're going to push north and northwest. Uh, north but east, my units there. are we're all kind of scattered right now, so let's get the, them together. Uh, away. And then send them out over here, I want to say. Let's order them back at the base. Because I've got a bunch of different unit reports I'm trying hey, to coordinate sorry, I with. I run from the engagement zone. Uh, these both BDRMs are down, and uh, Duck is dead. I think Andrew's dead too. Bogo, this is uh, Alpha. We're close to you. Get to regroup with us. Where are your BRDMs? I know. We're engaging the infantry against you. That's Makarov. It's by this BDRM now. Some of these guys are pushing across and against. Fallout crawled right up to a machine gunner and gets absolutely mowed down. Uh, where is Eander? What was that, Rutger? I'll try it again behind a rock. <clears throat> but they're under a heavy firefight right now. Alpha, you on this net? I'm gonna call in my roaming car to come say hello. Alpha, Alpha you copy. Okay. Okay. Uh, how, how, give me status update on you. We got uh, RPGs firing back forth. Makarov just fired that at this. All of Alpha is currently up, but we're heavily engaged. <laughs> Solid. You're still. And we got guys down right here now. that are trying to, you know, coordinate everything. Then you're going to. But be I think this is um maneuvers for some the pretty tough AL. The this. thing is, I um, want to use hostages, the but they keep bleeding out too fast. And, uh, clear out the, and we just try uh, to take a hostage, they outright nuke them. Copy. But there needs to be a little more talk when they do these things. Start setting up mines. I still want to use my mines when I oh. Well, there's air. Air is back online, and they are not giving any fucks about what I send up. They're back in that MI-28. <laughs> and it looks like they have two of my camps outlined. 
But I'm going to give a fallback order here, try to do a tactical withdrawal. Bravo is getting the last of our guys up, and then we'll be ready to advance. Solid, just Some are still firing back and forth here. We need, to, we need to get going on this. That's the thing, it would take too long to give them the VIX, so we're just packing them out in the uh, field. Ah, Alpha, this still is got there. three guys, four guys up. Alpha, if you can hear me, uh... Yeah, you guys are just gonna get bogged down in a firefight there. We can't do anything to support you. you Alright, so my AA off. guys got schwacked. From the looks of things. That, or they never completed their order. But they definitely left camp. No, they didn't. Yeah, like, just... You guys, I told you forever ago. Come out to this open field. And look for that plane. Or, not the plane, the frickin' any air vehicles that are shooting down us, because we have reports of them doing that. Otherwise, I've got these guys trying to retreat. They're covering their six. Hold on, I'm gonna quickly try to get a spawn effect down. This is, bro this is Alpha 2 Air, do you copy? Go ahead. Throw some smoke to cover my retreat. Drop some missiles if possible east of the camp. We don't see any targets, but we know they're in the bushes there. And then dead goal. I, none of these guys have line of sight on them. Uh, they just requested air to come in and do an airstrike. This is why I want my iglas ready. But they're not in position yet. So I'm not going to be able to see them coming. So what is their current plan right now? Because they need to get reinserts. They just said something to happen I want to capture dead gold but I don't have line of sight on him for any of my troops if you don't answer repeat last okay that was that close was perfect. thank you air that wasn't perfect you just fucking knocked two of your guys off a battle tower The fuck was Makarov calling in? He's the one that fell off the tower. But I think something that I really rarely see because I'm rarely able to create it. But what's going on right now and I really relish in is you can feel the fear that these players have. They just called an airstrike in danger close because they have no idea where these gorillas are. And yet they are separated. They got their fucking ass kicked. One of them's pushing up on their own while the other one's here. They're dividing their force. This that's not gonna go well. Round here, Alpha. But you can feel the fear coming in and making them make mistakes. And that's what Zeus saying that the pinnacle of Zeus saying is to get Round well. Here, Alpha trained players in that relay. state because this is a whole new type of training. Copy, Alpha is taking up defensive positions inside the uh, previous camp. No more firefight. Solid on here. Don't take up uh, defensive positions then. Move e move uh, northeast it's towards the objective. the best thing you can objective. do. Bravo's on the uh, eastern side. We're going to be uh, hitting Yeah, him broken the arrow. Shortly. Make them fear the AO. Right, and then through that fear, they either crash and burn, or they Send rise the and again. kick the entire AO's uh, ass. To to this is the hand I dealt them. They need uh, to adapt. Oh, nine, four, five. Oh, and I will five, say, nine, two of the three five. times, it kicks their ass. One Sounds of the three coffee. times, we see some of the best goddamn Arma gameplay you can ever fucking see within Arma. So let's see how it goes, shall we? Yeah, maybe the perfect airstrike was uh, sarcastic. Who knows? Hey, Garv, how are you? So we have infantry pushing up. They're either... This is the position of the camp they got. It was... 085945. It won't give me an intel tab because I set it so that only one person could pick it up, which was Grizzly, which was also squad lead, so he was able to quickly get that through chain of command. 
Yeah, they don't know this is there. They're just scanning the road just for the sake of it. But I got that gas coming in. It's out of that Vic's line of fire, so he might be able to get there in time. Are you retarded? There you go. There you go. Here, I thought you were fucking Reserve retarded. Take your team straight west. Don't go. Uh, don't go north of the road. Here, we know there's an aircraft, so I'm gonna have him get out west. prematurely. That Alpha, or or made it in time. Alpha is just about to move out. I'm gonna run Solid. these guys over and get them ready to go on the front. Taking contact north, command. They just took contact. We're gonna go engage. But I am low on Vix to send on him. One of their roaming patrols. I'm gonna also send this garrison over to reinforce. They're trying to disengage. So as long as I keep hearing gunfire, I'll have these units start to follow. Otherwise, this is rare where you can get the AI in a uh, position to retreat, but we are able to pull it off there. I'm gonna delete some of the bodies. But so far, FPS uh, for server performance has been around 45, which is really, really good. These guys are coming down. As the commander who is right now surrendered in that building, the guy they're trying to capture, I'm trying to coordinate units right now. My strategy now is okay. So we had a really good firefight over here, but the Russians are still trying. So I'm gonna, I know I've got a roaming group somewhere down here. We just lost contact with them, but they are definitely starting to come close, so we need to be careful. I'm actually going to send this group to go over and reinforce times now. Because we need to strengthen our southern border. Because it's quite possible we have intel that may lead them to my position. So these guys are now sweeping the forest, trying to find evidence of them. But as soon as I hear gunfire, we're going to have a large group come in. Got this other large group of infantry that'll be able to go around and hopefully outflank them. And then I've got this guy on the Igla looking for that chopper. Which, if he looks around, is anyone actually looking in that direction? He looked in that direction. Eyes on. Missile out. We're trying to take evasive. That looks like that hit him. Two twenty eight just got stingered. We're we're dead. Look out for missile AA, everybody. All right, have them RTB at a camp. We got some boxes of ammo. We can get her rearmed. I'm gonna keep one guy over here for Overwatch. <laughs> I think she's going to be able to auto-rotate it out. Going in a bit too quick here. Uh, pull up. Come on, you guys. I know you guys can do this. Yep, they're cutting it. Basically, I think they're going to be able to glide it back to base, but I do hear gunfire, so we got to quickly come back here and see what the hell's going on. They're engaging that camp. So I gotta bring my force back. And I 
I've got this large group. I need a task in times now. Try to overwhelm them. 28 down safe. Yep, so they got the 28 down. Good. It survived. Normally, they're not so lucky, but they pulled a last minute evasive action. Helicopter totaled. Pilots, is the bird unrecoverable? Actually, DACA is going to do it. Uh, DACA, this is High Command. You on net? I'm here. Roger, if you can coordinate with air, get the R&R &R VIX to them. Possible to uh, fix the bird. Roger that. Andrews, the jumping vehicle. Let's go. But hey, auto-rotate out. You can save the asset and still use it, but it delays it from being used, which is exactly what I want. Because that puts it out of the game and now forces the infantry to have to work with what they've got. So got a few men down. These guys pushed up on their own. I didn't hear at any of that over radio. Now these guys are starting to come up to assist. Dead goal. I'm just going to kill them off at this point because no one's coming to help them. Might as hell. I got this guy. He's crippled, but he's coming back. He hears that gunfire. And now we're starting to see casualties scale up because of the forest. But... This was a really bad idea to move up on this position. They didn't check the intel and yet. A, uh, and, a grab the and it's only going to get worse because I got more stuff coming in. So this guy has his Igloo rocket back. They have their orders. Get back on the uh, AA area over here and look for more targets. Multiple targets, grenade gets thrown. We're seeing a lot of guys get wiped because people are going out on their own. Now, what's the difference between this and what originally happened at this AO? And the answer is simply they were all together. But since they decided to split their force in half, as I predicted they would end up doing, and one squad attacks while the other squad's getting their shit together, one's gonna get butchered because this AO is designed to be attacked by half of their unit. It's designed to be attacked by all of it. Oh, look at this. Soaring's trying to get Kerbal Space to safety, but he's just running right in enemy infantry, and it's very likely that he's going to be taken out for it. He's being suppressed by a freaking machine gunner shot in the back, and he goes down with him. It is really just Bravo, Killa yeah, and Rat King still the here. See, people like to say that these guys can shoot through the trees and foil it, foliage, but that is not the case on this map because here's your fucking evidence. They don't shoot through the foliage. They're all kinds of fucked. We're saving them. They just see them through the foliage and then engage. They just see movement and they take them out. So positions like these are actually pretty good. But yeah, it was this was an unfortunate wipe. So Fallout's pushed up. He took out a guy. That was the cripple guy coming back. Capture them. I'll have to reassess the situation. I mean, look at this. There's a guy freaking on this tree right here. And now they just shot. Gave their position away. And now they're going to get outright massacred. Because look at the amount of infantry that have pushed up to their position. Grenade gets thrown. Rat King goes down, Killer trying to defend himself with a pistol, but unfortunately gets taken out. Rat King wakes back up, so does Killer. They're surrounded by enemy infantry, this is an absolute mess. Finish them. Alpha be advised, um... Pockets woke up again as well. Let's have the machine gunner push up. He's crawling under a tree to try to save him. This guy's looking around with his little girly glasses. Instead, he's firing at the reinforcement. Oh, he saw Rat King. Puts the entire frickin' belt into him. But this group, holy crap. Absolutely wiped. Welcome to the 
shit. I'll try to take these prisoners right here. But Pockets keeps waking back up, so it's really difficult. Try to take these guys. Come on, buddy, get over here. I can't take prisoners when we're in an active firefight. Eander's pushing up on his own. He's gonna basically prevent me from taking anyone prisoner. I have to really secure the area. Why did I wake up so much? Yeah, freaking machine gunner. Eander has to be pushed back because I have to be able to move these prisoners and he's cutting off my escape. But once this area is considered clear, I can start working. They're popping smoke. They're getting up to my camp right now. Honor completed, I command. Roger. Well. Um. Um, what? How are you doing? Oh, I'm going horribly currently. Really? Oh, that is a shame. I ran out of Nutella. You ran out of Nutella? I'm just eating Nutella out of a jar at this point. Mm, that's a shame. Oh boy. I mean, I gotta get rid of your radio. Oh, Gabian even has the wrong fucking radio. That's cute. Good work. Ground command, this is air. We're back up. Uh, what's, uh, what's going on? You guys? All right, who's ready to go on an adventure? That's a good answer. No. The other assholes around here to take us around. Can you find racking? I want racking. Yeah, can you find racking? Well, I know what that little like. He's the other medic. Everybody freak out in small Russian language sounds like now. I forgot what that fucking meant. I honestly didn't even realize. I was like, what was that sound? Usually it would, it would only start talking to me if something sickness. was going wrong, and I looked over all, right. all the instruments, and I was like, oh, that's good. Then I looked over on the right, Let's and I saw go! the fucking block on, and I was like, oh, God! And that's when I threw it over, but I forgot the fucking... I forgot the <laughs> dumb player. Let's go! We're gonna go have so much fun! Yeah, PNR well, works emphatic, okay, I know. That's not the one we normally we use. The tow machine now. Stay advised, now I'm pretty sure man died. We're going on a trip to our favorite rocket ship. Anyone a fan of that one? Jesus, this is so seasick. Shh, it's okay. Well, you see, you're not really like good prisoners, so. This is more torture than what I'm gonna do. Negative. Great! Yeah, oh man, I need I'm I'm not even looking at the screen right now. It's pretty inconvenient. Oh my goodness. Oh, okay. I'm glad you guys are having a good time. Well, I was having a good time. This is so bad. It's okay, you'll live, maybe. I'm not gonna live, I'm gonna throw something up and leave. Uh, We're gonna put you on a fire pit and roast you! Yay, Intel! Wait a minute, that's not how you get Intel. Wait. Oh, well, maybe I wanna roast you alive because I don't like Russians. Oh, okay. I mean, can't you tell by my sexy American accent? It tastes terrible. Fuck you. <laughs> you die first. He, he tastes. So Eander pushed up, he got hit. Look. If I'm gonna be honest, I probably do taste better. But it was better in You're gonna taste better? I'm stringy and my tracksuit has has kept me quite, quite lanky. I, I taste terrible. Well I also do better in health, so true. Alright, so why are you guys here anyway? Well, well I heard there was I heard there was something called Disney. Disneyland. Uh, we, we up, but their pilot has to set up an emergency. I gotta get up for like one minute. All right, so so, so this isn't this Disneyland. Is Alpha talking on 15 short wins. Do you copy? 
I don't know what his main purpose was, though. Here, uh, what was your, what was your short range frequency? Copy. Let's start with that, because I technically took your radio, so you gotta tell me. Like, well, actually. I had the wrong radio, so you can't, I mean, why, what's the point? Okay, the then Mr. J. Short range was 60. Okay. Thank God, sea sickness over. All right, let's get to the real fun. Why? Well, this is really the only way to torture people, so... You know... Actually putting me over a... Yes! This is, this is how we torture people. You're a monster! This is why we fight you. <laughs> no, this is why we fight you. Oh, my shins. They smell delicious. What are you doing over there, buddy? I'm gonna go capture oh. someone else. Uh, okay, I'm done with this. This would hurt like hell in real life. Good lord. Be brutal. Well, well, well. If it isn't the Grand Inquisitor himself. I've got rights. No, you're in Russia, motherfucker. There's no such thing as rights. Does that mean I only have wrongs? Yes, many, many wrongs. It's awkward. Very. Ignore the person that just moved in front of you, it's because the AI pathing's terrible. Anyway. Good. Are you ready to go on an adventure? It's good. Alright, let's go. You crippled or just slow? I guess I'm just slow today. Oh, he's crippled. Fuck. Well, I'm going to cripple the other guy and say he brought you and heal this one. Yay. Yay. Just say he's crippled. <laughs> All right. So under the Fair Geneva Convention, uh, I'm okay. not treated humanely with respect for my... We're gorillas. We don't follow Geneva. I must be able to inform my next of kin and the International Committee of the Red Cross of my capture. I must be allowed to communicate regularly with relatives and receive packages. Okay. I must be given adequate food, clothing, housing, and medical attention. Okay. I must be paid for work done and not forced to do anything dangerous, unhealthy, or degrading. The right to be released quickly after conflict's end. And I okay. am not compelled to give any information except my name, rank, and service number. Okay, what's your rank, name, and service number? Uh, Corporal Ian of the, the, the army. Okay. Two, three, go fuck it. That's great. Oh, hold on. This is I command send traffic. Can we uh, can we uh, requisite another BDR two BDR uh, M's unarmed? Roger. I'll provide another. Be advised, this is the last asset I will give you till next mission. A lot of them got fucked in that one. What was your radio frequency? Uh, for the short range? 65. Yeah. 65? Okay. So we have 60 and 65. Hello, radio check 1 2, radio check 1 2. <clears throat> Radio check one two. Radio check one two. Radio check one two. Radio check one two. Who is this? Russians. This is not your war. We are a free people within the society. 
We have many of your men captured at this time. We will be willing to exchange them in exchange for you to leave us alone. Let's change Call in the D21s. Execute them all. You know the frequency. Order 221. I'm sorry, you want us to execute them all? <laughs> well, team that's doing the AO, are you Bravo or Alpha? This is Alpha on short range 50, do you copy? We're just gonna fucking, we're gonna call them Alpha now because they're still alive. Um, team is right. replaying the town as, uh, as, uh, Bravo. We copy, you doing cast for Alpha right now, can you get comms? Alpha, go. Okay. This is Alpha on short range 50, do you copy? Hey, yeah, very my copy. Do what do you need? We have few men, we're currently we're falling kind of back. Enemies have captured a lot of our men. They have our frequency, we have switched, and they might have our long range frequency as well. Copy. Uh, this is High Command on frequency 50. I will never infiltrate your long range frack, so... Copy that. Well, they have our frequency already switched. They have our men. They said they're going to execute them unless we pull out. And we ourselves are too wounded to move back in without any support. Copy. How many men are you? We are. Uh, wait one. These guys have to Am I gonna IED them? Nah. Uh, nine people. Uh, almost everybody was crippled. Sorry, Eagles. Roger, you're too deep in the woods for me to pull out with the 28. So, you're kind of on your own unless you want me to go back and get a transport bird. Hey, fur, we're on our own. We're going to be moving back. Sniper, can you relay to them that I want them to hold their current position? Uh, Bravo, the reinsert team is going to drive straight to them and we're going to infantry blob the next camp. Alpha, this is Air. Ground command's requesting that you hold position and defend yourself. <laughs> Ground reinserts are coming to come help you or something. Copy that, that, do hey, do you guys, um, do you guys know where your friends are? Uh, copy, I'd like to the send drone up. I could, but I don't have anything. Oh uh, yeah, can I just with. fucking check the map? Ah, uh, that's a shame. It's just okay. Copy that, we're gonna be holding. I have drone in between the three of you. This is now ritual. With your blood, drone will find them. No. I have the rights to be treated humanely. This isn't humane. The Geneva Convention doesn't allow you to spit roast us. Was that humane? It was a good miss. Oh, what about <laughs> that? <laughs> Just shoot him in the head, That was also a good, good miss. Job. Good, good, good. Okay, what about this? <laughs> Actually, no, 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 no. This, this one over here, he's quiet. I like him. I will only shoot him in leg. What? Because I can! Fuck you! Anything else? Fuck you again! Come on, keep shooting me, kill me, you bitch. Make you. <laughs> I will make you kill me. Do it. And do it. I know you want to. Oh, it's okay, you just slowly bleed to death. You set the blade to fire. Hmm. What kind of stacks I have. This is Alpha talking to 50. Yeah, Anybody copies? Alpha, ground here. Read you one by five. Copy oh, that. There's another a camp oh, that's sense. marked on the map. Who we did I capture? Yeah. Mr. J, Eander, and Gabriel. In the camp we assaulted, saying that there's a camp on grid of 090947. Solid copy. Um, we're going to. Hey. I will be right back for one moment. Well, I command off comms on my. I'm just gonna lock my door and quickly go like You guys are gonna survive this. Okay. Hey, uh, you guys can hear me better. We're gonna uh, clear that road to your west. We're gonna tear up to the uh, tear up the road in this BDRM, uh, and we're going to infantry blob the next camp uh, to the best of our ability. And bleeding. If you need to fall back, fall back west. I've been they shot really in the knee twice. I took two bullets to the knee. Flurries aren't that bad. Do you at least go down swinging? I tried my goddamn this. I called out my position. I shot a load of rounds. I didn't have any grenades. I would have pulled the pin on one of I was, was told twice in a row through the 
just really random trees. I think I was carrying you at the time, actually. Hmm? I killed the guy who shot you. There's no way to uh, get serious in the line. He'd get in doubt on me if he'd stop shooting. I. Because fuck, I want out of here. Want to be eaten by this uh, masturbating fellow here? Oh, KPN, that's very presumptuous of you. Look, I don't like being eaten. Do you think you're more delicious? Me and Mr. J already went over. But you wouldn't, you wouldn't want to eat me. It's, it's a fatty meat. It's not good for you. That's what I said. I said my tracks is maybe Ground. Can we confirm yeah. that the HVT yeah, is you know, not in the first two, in the last two camps up on the top left? We can confirm that he is not in the first camp we cleared or the second camp we cleared. Uh, and we got intel from the, um, the, the here marker, um, there to lead us to another camp, but we don't know where he was. Or, I don't know where, what you're talking about right now, so just put a giant blue circle on what ones you know that are clear, or that we can kill. How are you guys doing? We still doing good? Blue squiggles over the two camps that are perfectly clear and open to, uh, to No, we're just playing the game, who's gonna fall unconscious first? I love this game. Oh, I, I will. You want to see the sign that Philip got? I, They're I fucking debating you know. who's gonna taste best. <laughs> ah, a great place to go AFK if this is what they're gonna fucking do. <laughs> oh, yeah, this is this is my player base, all right. You remotely pull the pin. Yeah. I'm just gonna move this up to about 125 and look around. Alright, a little above 25, that's fine. I'm gonna go to Gunner. Alpha to Bravo, how do you want us to proceed? Got a BRDM coming up. Hold position for another uh, 90 seconds, we're almost there. We're gonna infantry blob up to the another camp marker on uh, at 090947 and uh, look for the HVT there. Let's see where they stop, I'll call mortars on them. Lost eyes for a second. There he is. Actually, it's probably contusion, actually. It's contusion. Because it wouldn't bleed. Contusion. Hold on, what was that on contusion. my right? Oh. Contusion is technically a, like... Well, we have him now with the drone. Yeah, that's, what I, that's what I think. Because Slender, I can't read Russian. I'm sorry, man. I was requesting a medic to pack or medic. Or medic's name is uh, rule commander. Well, our drone found them because they drove a car right up to the other group's position. So guess what we're doing now? We're having a conversation. I don't care who tastes best. You're all gonna taste good, okay? It's gonna be great. Look, calm down. I'm trying to fire some mortars here, okay? Like, chill, dog. Oh shit, you found my mortar. Well, good thing you're dead. Not dead. That's fake news. You're fucking cooking right now, you should be dead. <laughs> oh man, that's fake news. I feel fine. I have I have insulating underwear, okay? I can stand here forever. And I have some of that like I, I uh, poked some of that American under armor that's up. flame retarded. And I'm feeling great. I'm it's like retarded. a warm summer day. Some of it is flame. I'm a little just bit retarded. of player wrecked most of it summer day. There's more just landed to the west, it seems. Time to send my infantry. Oh shit, they're coming from my yeah, camp. It's like when you walk across the coast. If you touch it for a second, you're okay. Okay. What do you guys think? Infantry squad or BMP? BMP. Uh, BMP. Wow, you guys are assholes. Okay, BMP. <laughs> 
You know, if you said Liberty first, I would have given it to you, but otherwise, I guess we're going to go for BMP. I want to have fun. Just like we're having fun. Oh, we're having the best fun. Okay. Let's see. Ba -ba -ba Gather around our campfire. Not National Guard. And if you don't think we can sing it faster, server then loads at well, 17. We'll just have a few sing along. Alright, I'll do what I can to negate the load. I'll have to delete my goats too, because it's really starting to bog down. Initial engagement started. Oh, Mox wakes back up. <laughs> what? The actual fuck? That killed me. <laughs> ah. Um. I'm... There we go. Good god, that was a bit of lag there. <laughs> Little bit of an extended black screen. I've never seen that one before, but yeah, that thing landed. Coming and clearing that position out. And I also have the BMP coming in as well. Alright. So, my brother bought Apex Arma 3. Any tips you can give him? Honestly, it depends on what he ends up liking and disliking, you know? Because there's so many different things within Arma, you can't really predict what someone's going to like about it. Some people prefer Vanilla Ops, some people prefer Milsim, some people prefer uh, Altus Life, huh. some people prefer the King of the Hill stuff. Just, you know, go around and try what you can, and from there, see what you like. Did Infested Daka bring a freaking Car 98 or is that a Mosin? I can't tell, but that's a freaking bolt action rifle. Why? Like, your combat effectiveness is absolute shit. If you do that. So look at that, they've caught him in the open. And that chopper is staying way out of bounds. Nice. What? I'm not the enemy commander, I'm just one of his sergeants. Okay. 28 took oh, uh, another no, angle, we're, we're going in. Anyone else? Oh, there we go, now he's cooking. I call that a win. I did not believe that first. You're right. Yeah, this is rough. Hey, do you copy? Well, yeah, you're captured. Yeah, no. This isn't exactly the fucking Hilton um, Hotel. We've got contacts east of us down the road. I'm gonna highlight an area I want you to hit with. Motherfucker, uh, we're going down. You're on your own. Yeah. Solid copy. Another Thank you for your service. So, no. Yeah, whatever. They got hit again. Makes sense. Look, you're just a meal. I'm the service afterwards. Okay. <laughs> I think the other Igla chair got him. Yep, it's fired a shot off. I got that BMP coming in as well. That camp is clear. Negative PDRs. Too many wounded inside of it. Don't use this cover. Gonna scale that up. Call another artillery strike. Uh, let's see. That's the wrong one. We gotta go up here. Put some shells there, right? Break these guys all apart. Send them down range. 
Then when the time is right, I will send in the BMD to support them. Huh? I meant no. Let's uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? Well, let's see how Taylor landed. I'm over in the northeast. Man, it's just trigonometry. Also, in case they didn't get overridden by the global skill, we're gonna put that up. Is Bloodlust on? I haven't had Bloodlust on in months. Uh, just because its settings can be very difficult and very non-player friendly. And there's roasting on an open fire. My chestnuts are far from being done, sir. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, Eander's the lead of one of the squads. Hiru, uh, the golden plump that was sitting on the fire right there is... The I got an RPG guy, guy, guy waiting. Hi. He's going off. Look, you can see him through the fire and the flames. Teachers double tapping bodies. Ring, 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 ring. Banana phone. Banana phone. <laughs> Trying to keep that BMP parallel to Banana that group of infantry. I'll give him another movement order in just a second. Oh. Hey, you guys, want to hear something funny? Since you're not gonna live, why not? Our commander's a fucking genius. He's actually in between both of the last two camps. You're never gonna find him. Cause you're all gonna roast over the open goddamn fire! <laughs> Love my job! Yeah, you say that, but you sound like you have morbid depression. I do. It's chronic. Alright, right, let's send the BMP up. Make sure you get some therapists to sort that out. It yeah, nothing a good bullet can't solve. I mean, just talk to your buddy, Yander. Yeah, what the fuck did you stumble on? Uh, three people cooking. Five golden death. <laughs> Fucking. Also, it took you a lot of shots to actually hit him, so. Wait, I can't help that freaking 9mm bounces off Russian plate. Fucking. So the Vic crew just traded with Makarov. But I'm nice. Quotation marks. BMP is gonna report that just took fire. Let's uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? Have these guys come over and coordinate, and we'll eliminate. Because at this point, I'm just cutting them off and taking them. Swantinus had a wedding. I'm gonna order this Igla group to fall back. Skies are clear. We need to just have everyone survive. Because I'm out of units to my pool. I'm gonna kill you with jokes. No! You're not gonna kill me with jokes. I'm just gonna execute you. Look, you can kill so many of us, you get the price to kill yourself. Fucking Russian! See? You cannot trust them! You cannot trust the Russian, because they'll just tell you! Mortar, fire! Also, I can back up. So good. Artillery, fire point blank, now! Fire! 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 Shoot the guy on the artillery! Come on, come on, come on! You shut your mouth! There's a guy behind us! There's a guy behind us! He's just dismounted! Guys, get up! To hell with this! No, please! <laughs> They're killing the people on the fire! No, 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 no. Frag! Oh, you got a guy down. Quit throwing fucking grenades. 
No. Push into the other side. Double, oh, double check, double check the bodies, double check the bodies. This guy, this guy was surrendered. Oh, here they are. Pull him out of the fires. No, pull him out of the fires. I'm dead checking. He ender, they dragged him out. Down. Ground to high command, hard copy. Oh I'm shit. Where's <laughs> This is high command send traffic. We've got uh, eyes on, we just cleared another rebel camp. We've got um, uh, mortars and uh, weapon caches here. Are we to detonate them? Uh, Roger, that would be a good idea. Uh, has the person been captured yet? Negative. No uh, No idea where he is. We've not, Roger we've that. Not uh, did anyone surrender at the camp for you to try to interrogate? Maybe the hostages know something. Solid. We'll ask our hostages. They probably tried to surrender, but you know, Russia. You know, you put up good fights. Unfortunately, you are now mine. So you don't How need this, that. Oh, I don't know. I wasn't keeping track of your kill count. Also, I'm taking away your body on, but I'll let you keep your cool helmet. Awesome. So my buddy Sergi is saying we have another person that we need to go capture. Ah, he's coming over now. So we're going to go on a trip. Let's, uh, let's give him a warm welcome, shall we? And away we go. Man, I'm not really a fan of this whole Russian cause. But... Oh, you're not? Hmm. Well, maybe you should not have taken up arms for your great friends. I got drafted, man. Oh, you got drafted. Well, that's, that's a shame. Seek out, get the other one up. High command, uh, interrogative. This is high command, send traffic. Would the other two camps we've spotted to the north, uh, north, northwest have, uh, intel inside of them? Or uh, perhaps negative, your hostages should have intel. Solid. <laughs> Oh my god, you are... I, I am very drunk today. I can tell. Okay, here is other one. Oh. Hey, Let's see, you don't need radio, you don't need launcher, you don't need pistol, you don't need body armor, you don't need that. Okay. Kerbal, were you drafted too? Let us Who's go. Kerbal? My bad, I thought you were Kerbal. No. Yeah, you can't really see names here. We were the AT squad that got ran over. Hi, Command and Ground Command, you copy? This is ground command, send traffic. Roger, if no intel is assigned, I'd say just comb around in between the two camps, see if you can hear any gunfire or hear any noise. Solid copy, we'll listen for some, uh, for some sick Euro beats. <laughs> uh, Roger.
So, what's his favorite hobby? Personally, yeah. I like sewing. You like sewing? Billiards. That is that is rare. Billiards I can understand, but sewing, hmm, that, that is rare talent, my friend. It's a shame that Commander will probably execute you both. But at least we had good talk, yes? Yeah. I mean, as long as we have good talk, that is always best, right? I suppose it is. Anyway, let's me call him out. Commander! Oh, he's probably going to want this. Ah, uh, let us see. Where is he? Well... Look at this, two Russians. It's a shame you're gonna die like dogs, but hey, at least it was all in good fun, right, gentlemen? Your it's commander sends units, I send mine. That's just the nature of the game. But I was drafted, I don't even wanna be here. I know. A lot of us get drafted, but, you know, not everyone wants to play this game. You know, this Glock 17 was given to me by an American colleague. It's probably why you guys want me dead, or captured, or worse. Anyway, gentlemen, it's been an honor. Any last words? Any last requests? I'll fight for you. You'll fight for me? Well, I got plenty of loyal men. Sorry. What's your name? You want a Kit Kat? Cool, you still have air for transport, but the AA presence. Here, I'll give you a Kit Kat. There's no point of throwing shit at the airfield. There's a force. Thank you, Master. Solid copy. Uh, we'll let you know if we need you. We're doubling back to uh, the area we were, we've already cleared for the commander. Nope. Apparently, Fire he was away. hiding. Alright. Um, cool. We may call need you to be back in. Yeah, we'll do. Alright, let's go. Booby trapped the bodies, set up some trip wires just in case they heard that they're still in the AO. Otherwise, let's get the fuck out. You probably want your gun back. Start telling everyone to pack up. We're gonna get the fuck out of here. Thank you, comrade. Why do all the rebels sound the same? And the commander doesn't sound Russian. Exactly. The commander isn't Russian. Uh, we're not going to take my car. They probably got air in the air. All of our AA has been schwacked. We do have an Igla, though. Keep that guy with us. We're all going to disperse in small groups in about five minutes. So get ready. Send a small team to recon the northern route right now. Report back in a few. We already had a small group uh, fall back to the north, northwest, but otherwise it should be good. Rig the tripwires, will you? I'll be in the front of the building. Let's get ready to go. Now, you're probably wondering why I'm saying all this, and this is because those guys that are unconscious can still hear me. So I have a few mines to rig, don't I? Let's see. Tripwire. Ow. Okay, on second thought, that probably wasn't the best idea. Bye, guys. Gunshots. 
Fuck. Air's back on. Go! Go! Start falling back immediately! Fall back, I repeat, fall back! Come on, you are behind the building. Rutger just triggered the mine. Ah, fuck, 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 fuck! Yep, nope, this ain't gonna work. Fuck! Ground, this is there. Did you guys find him yet, or are you just getting bamboozled? We're, uh, we're yeah, taking, hold on, hold on. HVT on foot right now. We're about to get him. What if he leads you into another camp, though? I don't know, man. Who knows? Anything can happen. Don't get bamboozled. This way. Got him. Or you got him. And drop shouted me. <laughs> ah, Russian armor bias, man. Rat King, come here. Gonna be You're on fucking here. global. Rat King over here. <laughs> Trying to run away with the HVT. They've triggered all of those fucking mines. Daka. Fuck, wow. Well, the HVTs are now dead because they literally triggered all of the fucking mines around them. <laughs> Kill him off. Go, 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 go. Oh, this should be good. Do you guys have the HVT? Confirmed. We're heading. We're. we're uh, he's in the BDR. I'm heading to the. Um, through the. Uh, he's heading to the uh, LZ marked on map. Question, have you cleared that LZ? Negative, it's out in the middle of an open field, so like four clicks from the AO, uh, or more than that, like eight clicks from the AO. Yeah, so I don't think my Igla uh, guys survived. Actually, no, there. I sent them over. Eight clicks, huh? Roger. Instead of that, let's go to Veramivo. Is my drone still up? Okay. Yep. Solid. Send that one out as well, and I'll ask them if they want to do a second op. Because honestly, the map, but that's this was a brutal meters. AO. I didn't mean for it to be that brutal, but it's because they split their force. The uh, the uh, BDRM wants you to meet them at the first base uh, for uh, medivac. Air, we're going to Veramivo. Ignore those fucking idiots. Yeah, I was going to Veramivo. Ground forces, there's literally no point of you being there anymore. Are you pulling out? You've still got stragglers. Confirmed. The Vic was full. Roger, we're walking out. We'll be okay. Just get the uh, BAP out of there. Kind of pointless if there's prisoners when we just went in there to save people. Yeah, there's still three slots in that car for three people. Why 
anyways, yeah, that was... That was an interesting AO. That first engagement... Honestly, it wasn't the first engagement that was brutal. They actually sweep this place very effectively. What was really talk brutal it, was when they back. started to push out and the three, but, uh, they had I'll a three-way push on them. Out, One of them was completely wiped by air, but the other two me, caught them off guard it, because only back, half their force pushed out while the other half was still in base. Solid, solid copy. And that's the that's the worst outcome of two different Muscle squad leads. Off a combat it's like that team MI for you. Team. I don't know. They wanted me to let you know. A combat journalist okay. team. Yeah, nice LZ eight clicks up. away. <laughs> what? <laughs> combat. <laughs> oh, this should be fucking good. <laughs> this fucking player base, I swear. What the fuck are you two doing? We're inbound, maybe like two mics, sniper. Russia Today reporting the war effort. And then show all the dead children. Show the dead kids the kills. Show all the dead the The fuck is this? Ask the dead people. God damn it, we're not fast enough. Just run! Fuck it. Just run, Forrest! So they unloaded him. We have to ask him why they are if they're raping him or not. <laughs> yeah, you guys Excuse are pretty us, safe, sir? so realistically you can probably just mount up in the UAZs and just try to take the 148 back. Are you treating your prisoner well? Are you following the course of the Geneva Convention? Jumped out of the helicopter. <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> you cannot leave my press. That's against all codes and conventions. This should be good. This this is so fucking
Oh my god, are you kidding me? Who the fuck are you? I am a, a, a Western investigative journalist here to here to document war crimes by the Russians. Oh. Okay. Yeah, yeah no, we can we can work with that. Shooting. Yeah, no, um, it's totally it's totally all the Russians. The Russians just came in here. We had to take up arms, you know, it's troubling times within Russia. Yeah. It's yeah, horrible. I've been documenting it. It's, it's horrible. Yeah, it's absolutely horrible that a Western journalist is about to be executed by a Russian AK. <laughs> and said Russian was then killed. Ah, such a shame. Ground command, this is high command. Is the HVT secured at base? So, uh, the HVT is secured at base. Roger, mission is a success. I repeat, mission is a success. They put them in a fucking box. That, that's mine. So let's, uh, let's pause our music. Give our good old victory noise for a completed operation. Ay, 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 though. That was, that was interesting, to say the least. Very interesting. All right. Well, up was a success. Bit of a uh, floundering, but you know, shit happens. Uh, the only mistake that was made time and time again, which is why floundering kept going on, was you guys kept splitting your force in half, and half would go. Oh, Jay. Hey. Jay, Jay you, you have a nasty hot mic. Thank you. Um, the only reason you guys kept floundering is because half like alpha would go one direction bravo would not and then alpha or bravo would go one direction alpha would not and whatever squad just went off on their own kind of got fucked because you divided your force in half yeah no problem jay but um yeah it's just same issue we've always had you know if one squad attacks while the other one's like waiting around for orders or reinserts you know it's one squad's just gonna get fucked because they're taking on, like, a freaking force that's supposed to be taken on by your entire group working together. That first assault you did on that first compound? Near flawless. You cleared it out, you killed everything. The only person that... Actually, no, um, just a few a few people went, um, at KI... Uh, not K... Jeez. Okay, words. All I'm trying to say is that first assault was perfect. Cleared the compound, everything did well. Then one squad decided to push out while the other stayed. That one squad got fucked. Other squad came up, then pulled back because they were taking too much fire and didn't want to get stuck in the same position. I then used that opportunity to basically retreat, regroup, and then reassault. Uh, but yeah, just stay together. You don't have to attack an AO from two flanks because that's not going to be good while. An air can only, you know, come in a few times before I start setting up iglas to uh, schwack them. So all in all, guys, just classic stick together. Have alpha, like, within 100 meters of Bravo or whatever and attack from the same direction. That way if one squad gets fucked, the other can go over and reinforce. Because if you just literally go all around willy-nilly and start breaking your line, people are going to sneak by. And those people might have RPGs, and then they're going to blow up your VIX. So, you know, just classic flaws today. But other than that, I hope you enjoyed it. You still got the HVT in the end. I had a good bit of fun. I hope all of you did. And one of your press guys, I executed him for stupidity. So, I yeah. If I was about to do the same. Don't worry. Sniper Wolf, anything to add?
Cool. Anything from you, Bill? Um, awesome. No. Uh, who was ground command for that app? It was Pockets. Pockets. Pockets, do you have anything to say? No. We just blob tactics work way too well. I hate it. I want to do more than blob tactics, but um, it just seems to work too well. You don't have to do blob tactics. You can have one squad assault from like the southeast and another squad assault from the southwest. But as long as as long as you have territory to then you know send like let's say one squad loses their medic, as long as you can send your medic to them within like. 100, 150 meters via, you know, pu pulling them south with a detachment for escort so then get to them and make sure you're not going to be molested along the way, then yeah, that's perfectly fine to use tactics in that sense because then you can cover more of the area in case people try to retreat. Tactics work, it's just sending one group to assault from the east and one to the west, well, yes, your pincer are moving it and you're cutting it off from both directions, but... What's in between you and your allied forces, enemy forces? And then that also creates a crossfire, so any stray bullets could potentially kill friendly forces. So it's the thing about using the right tactics is what'll work. What uh, I call then, that maneuver. Hey, is the what was with the vehicle selections we had? Yeah, what do you mean? That's what I was going to ask about. It seemed like the, uh, the insurgents were as well armed, if not more well armed than us, aside from the air. But it, with the, the force being so thick, it's hard to call. Yeah, BDR aims are not exactly something that you like roll in with mass numbers. It's a freaking scout vehicle. It's literally just like a reconnaissance vehicle. It's, it's not like, even made for transportation. Too. Yeah, they, they get penetrated by literally everything. 7.62 penetrates them. Cool, maybe they shouldn't be on the front line then. Maybe you should have infantry in front of them to use them effectively. No, but like literally, like literally why are we getting, why, why were we limited the vehicles today? Because I wanted to see what you guys could handle. And I was right to the point of when you do the AO properly with tactics, it works. When you don't, it falters. And we're going to keep doing this until you get it right. Okay, okay, okay so, why, so why, were the, why were the enemy running around the fucking BMPs? Uh, they only had one BTR and one BMP, and that was only brought in because you guys faltered twice, and I was able to take two groups of hostages. So, yeah. and also, what was the what was the, the mortars the whole time? Like literally, I know you, you don't like people f uh, like slowing down, but then you uh, first compound, uh, I mortared outside twice just to get you guys going again because you had vehicles you could load up and displace because there were still people from the first firefight. Uh, that were basically in the tree line scouting it out and ranging for the mortars. And the second group of mortars, that's because I finally sent up a drone and watched your BDRM reinforce and walk, uh, drive right up to your infantry group. And once I confirmed that, I started mortaring that location, or at least near it. Now, those mortars directly hit you guys, but I used and spotted accordingly. Yeah, because, like, mortars don't, they, they don't do what you think they do. They don't speed people up. Typically speaking, when you drop a mortar... It's shrapnel, it cripples somebody, then we have to slow down because that guy gets crippled. Yeah, so I don't say don't use the mortars, but if you're trying to use mortars to get people to get momentum, it has the opposite effect. It just pointed it out there because that's what I always notice. Every single time mortars get dropped on an area to speed them up, it doesn't speed them up. Even if the mortar lands 50 meters from, the tar from where you dropped them, 50 meters is still within range of the shrapnel. And it's like literally you're, you're wounding people, they get crippled, and it actually slows the assault down. Yeah, but my, thing, my, my big thing was the vehicles are like literally, like I know you don't want to give us heavy vehicles, but the BDRM is like the strange choice for like the Russian best nice type group. Could have given us the gas instead, because the gas is the, you know, is the actual equivalent of the, Send of the American to use this stuff. now. Okay, that's noted, but I'm going to tell you right now, I'm not going to take that advice, and nothing's going to change. Yeah, that's fine. But then, you know, like, literally... Northern, thank you for the three months in the road, Twitch Prime, man. Appreciate it. It's okay. Especially, we'll, we'll, we'll if, especially, okay. If you, especially if you want to, like, have us be, like, a... Okay, a then, then let's... Force. Let me let me put it this way. Do you want transport trucks and UAZs, or do you want MRAPs again for next time? They're not MRAPs. 
they fucking beat him. The well, they're Stanford under Stanford the actual, MRAP category, so yeah, that's that's because RHS there, there literally is no MRAP. The actual vehicle MRAP equivalent is the gas. The little the gas truck. Of but the thanks, Norton. I appreciate it. Mike, Mike. That's the actual vehicle equivalent. Okay. Of the MRAP. Anything have anyone have anyone uh, anything else to say? Excuse me. <laughs> we have rules for a reason. So when tier one is your tier two ops, it's not the best thing. That's I didn't all. even notice that. You guys gotta let me know or let it tier five know so we can take care of that. Well, let no, I no. wasn't gonna start anything until, until I knew that nobody uh, let, let him join. Well, you, as far as I know, no, like you gotta let us know and then we'll tell you that he's either put in or like because because otherwise we don't know. I'm too busy setting up your op, so. I'm pretty sure PDK joined late as well. No, he was first crew with us. Uh, first Doesn't group. matter. What, Rube? Yes or no on this one? Yes or no on what? No. Damn it. I've already asked for that. Alright, well, otherwise, uh, do you guys... Uh, I honestly don't think we should do another op based on the first performance, so... Sniper, what do you think? Are you still playing with Puppy? We don't have much time left either. Only an hour left. Yeah. Oh, never mind, you extended the time. Yeah, otherwise, I think I'm gonna call it. Uh, tier 3 ops will start next week, it's just I wanted to use this operation to test the VIX. Uh, test cook off as well. That was another point of using a BTR and BMP. I wanted to see if their cook off was causing any issues, but it seemed to be fine. So it's just an issue. It, the server crashing issue is a very complex one involving assets from Eden Editor. So I'll have to try to adjust things accordingly. But we're probably going to go back to instead of having vehicles uh, based off of a template, you'll just ask me for what you want for Saturdays and such. And we'll go from there. Still no aircraft? Uh,. I'm probably going to limit it to helicopters. Right. Because it was something, it's, when we tested yesterday, it was very strange because people kept getting kicked exactly where your AO was. Nobody else could get kicked when we bombed other towns. Yeah. So did you I, spawn anything special in? Nope. It was literally just Middle Eastern Militia and two BTR-60s from their faction like I've always used, so. Did, so that question, did you did you spawn in the AI yesterday through the Eden editor? Or? Yeah, it was through the Eden editor, but I've done I've been doing that more recently, and we haven't had problems. But I'll I'll switch things up. But anyway, guys, um, yeah, that could be in the right. Where, yep. where were the aircraft spawned in through Eden? Yeah, that that um, usually that has caused issues before, and yeah, because Makarov, were yours Zeus spawned or Eden as well? The uh, the ones that I used were all Eden spawned. I never took the one that Liru. Oh. Actually, no, they all were Eden spawned. Yeah, so. Yeah, that, that, that was the issue then. No, oh, comes. Anyway, uh, hope you enjoyed the operation, and hopefully we can, uh, you know, improve. Because that's all this is, is about having fun and improving, so. Thanks, Yuru. Anyway, guys, that's all I'm going to do today. I'm going to work on some uh, other stuff. <laughs> we might have another AO later, but probably not, because, uh, you know... Shit happens. Anyway, guys, uh, thank you so much for watching. Go Send operate operationally. Now. Muscle Man, thank you for the 499 sub. Hope you enjoy all future operations, and thank you again. Uh, but otherwise, 506 Zombies stuff, I still haven't gotten around to publishing that because it's been a bit of a pain because I've been juggling so much stuff at once because I'm also in the middle of finals and shit. But otherwise, guys, take care. Hope you enjoyed doing that. Uh, worth watching the replay? Yes, I would definitely agree. We had some good funny moments, but otherwise, guys, take care. Have a good one.